Two things you have to do before you do anything in this video. Number one, unplug the refrigerator. Number two, turn off the water source to the ice maker at the wall. At the wall. Or Brian, I'm making a quick video because I look for videos online, wreck my brain for months trying to figure out a rattling noise. First I thought it was a compressor down below or the fan down below, it wasn't that. Then I was convinced it was the fan inside. All the videos sh sh uh, that you look up on YouTube tell you it's the fan or the grommet up here. Anyways, long story short, I can tell you how to fix it for free without replacing any parts uh, if it's what I found in my fridge. Anyways, to explain how to take it apart real quick, ice maker was up here. You take out these two screws, you slide out the ice maker, you unplug it from here. There's two screws there. Pop this up, slide this out. Piece of foam. Jimmy it gently up in this particular model and it comes out no problem. Then you take the bottom out, two screws here, lift it up, comes right out. You got four screws after that, holding the back panel in place. I've already taken three out, but here's one, two, three, and here's the fourth. Take the fourth out, or I'm taking the fourth out for this video here. Make sure you keep track of the screw, otherwise it'll fall down here, and you'll waste your time for like an hour or whatever trying to find the freaking screw in the fridge. Pull out this panel. So what do you see that moves there? You got the fan, so that's obviously everybody thinks it's the fan that makes the noise. There's ground support fan in place. That could be it too, but what else? Wires. Long story short, make sure the wires are not touching the back of the fan or anything else that may cause a rattle. For some reason mine had migrated up to the back of the fan and it was sounded like something was broke or about to be broken. It was really loud. Um, so that's it. 